Hi everyone. Welcome to Sewing Seams with Deb. And today I'm just going to have a chat to you about the upcycled man's flannel shirt, the blue one. So I've got some images of me doing that process. And so my aim has uh, or was or is to um, make that into a a sort of in-between weather, either spring or autumn, to have it as a, something that it can just pop over, you know, over your jamas or the nighty, something that is just a little bit warmer than um, a brunch coat or a summer dressing gown. So um, it's especially good when going away somewhere for a weekend and you don't really want to take a big dressing gown with you. You, um, you just want to take something light and you might be going to a common kitchen or something. So you might want to be able to take something a little bit more glamorous than an old dressing gown. So um, this started out to be my, um, my sister had this idea uh, originally and, and I thought this is a great idea, but I'd like to jazz it up a little bit. I just don't want boring old man's shirt. I want to make it into something that's got a little bit more... Um, a little bit more pizzazz in it so what I've done with this shirt if it's a beautiful color you'll see and um, I've got a before photo as well as some some um, in, uh, some images of me doing the process so during the process I've um, removed the cuffs I just cut them off um, removed all the cuffs I've taken off all the buttons I've um, unpicked the top part of the collar. I've left the collar stand on in this case. So you'll see where I've unpicked the collar. Um, and also I have um, I've found some uh, binding in a op shop once, a long time ago. It was in my cupboard for ages, like literally years. It's been in there waiting for the right project. And this is the thing with upcycling. You gather bits of um, little bits of lace and bits of ribbon and old zips and various things that you might want to use on bags or or little garments that you're going to make or changes that you might make to an existing garment you don't want to throw it away but you want to change it into something else so you might want to embellish something so I have lots of boxes over there where I've got um, which I'll show you one day I'll go through my uh, sewing room and um, so I've got all these types of things. So I've had this by this edging. So it's got an actual collar. So I've installed the collar um, and uh, sewn that in on my beautiful new machine. Uh, I have um, put some of the edging on the wrists as well and, and around the bottom. So it's something in between a jumper or a cardigan and a, a light, very light, jacket shirt jacket so um, I, I'm now waiting for some slightly cooler weather so I can wear it um, but you'll see here I've put some um, images of me um, working out the best way to wear it the edge of the um, bottom of the shirt it was way too long so I chopped off some at the bottom and then I've made that into um, a long strip uh, so I can wear that as a headband I can wear it as um, a tie, I can wear it as a, a waistband or a, um, um, a bit of a belt if I want to. I can wear it with something else as a neck, just a like a scarf, a warm scarf around the head. It's going to be nice and warm around the ears in the winter without wearing a full beanie. So I think, I think you're going to like it. Um, I'd be really interested to hear um, what you think of it and um, make a comment and let me know what you think. Uh, so this is just a, a little short video for us to um, check in and for me to just give you an update on where I'm going with the upcycling and how I'm getting on. Um, it took me quite a few hours to get this done, but I really did take my time. I'm quite a slow sewer, I re especially when I'm in that creative mode. I really take ages to really think about and play with it and see what it looks like and sew it on and maybe unpick it if it didn't work so there's a lot of that that goes on um, so it's not a quick easy chop chop cut cut and so so 
um, it's a little bit more than that so I encourage you to do the same uh, when you see something in the um, in the shops that you might want to take and save uh, and just turn it into something else it's a lot of fun or even something in your wardrobe that you've already got or your husband or partner's wardrobe that that they're not using anymore ask them if they're willing to let it go a lot of them don't like to they like to leave it in their cupboard until one day they might lose that little bit of weight or they might change their mind and like that color now but just ask them if they might be interested in you making it into something else so um, I, it, it's it's a lot of fun and um, and we're helping save the planet so how good is that so thanks for joining me today um, and I hope you enjoy seeing all the images and the video of what I've put together and um, please like and please subscribe and uh, I'll be back real soon with something else that I've been making. So chat to you soon. Bye.